Hello YouTube, welcome to my channel. Today we have jewelry. I picked this one up. It's a cute little bracelet, vintage. I like the three circles. It reminds me of the Olympic symbol for some reason. And this was $25. It's probably about the price of the sterling silver weight alone. It looks really cute on. The next item that we have is also a bracelet and it's this beautiful I don't really know what to call this I know this is from Israel because I know this particular stone it's not Chrys Chrysocolla but this says 925 in here and it also says Israel Eilat E-I-L-A-T and that's what the stone is and you can only get that, I guess, in Israel. I don't know. But every time I see that on um, on a piece of jewelry, I know it came from Israel. It's really pretty. Very beautiful, deep green color with some kind of black or dark gray in there and all these striations. It's beautiful. I got this for, let's see, what price was that? $8.00. Cause you know that's how I do things. I'm gonna try and put this on and see, so you can see what it looks like on. It's really, really, really pretty. And then I have these simple Mexican sterling silver bracelets. That I got for about fifteen dollars each. I have a lot of. I actually have a lot of these in almost the. Well, actually, in the exact same pattern, and so I just double and triple and quadruple up on these and wear them all at once. Can you see the whole thing? And finally, I have this, which is not sterling. So, you know, it's very weird that I even purchased this in the first place. It was $6.99. Wait, 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 wait. Six. Wait, there it is. $6.99. This, not sterling. However, the chain sterling silver and I I really like this little tag at the at the back it has the maker's name Let's see if I can no nope. no but it says London Manor I'm trying to get it in focus but I don't I don't know that it'll work but it's really really cute 